I got Castle and Euphoria, I'm going to try to beat it with one hand. You know, there's a perfect opportunity to do it since I got the microphone in the other hand. Uh, it's probably, if I were to put this piece of paper under my snot, it's hanging down from the TV and it's about to drip off and onto the carpet. I got about, if, you know how icicles are, it's about an inch long, it's hanging down off the TV, about an inch of it's hanging down off the TV. And now, uh, well, yeah. I guess I can let you listen to this music right here. I'm not going to put the microphone right up to the TV, I'll just let you listen to it in the background. I might talk a little bit, you know. It's really good music. You can hear the lightning. I wish you could see the graphics on this thing, it's just stunning. This picture right here looks real. Um, anyway. Oh, gruff, cat. I don't even think about eating my snot. Can you believe that? He's sniffing at my... Ooh, look at that. It's dangling down from the TV and he's sniffing it. It's moving. Oh, this is weird. Right, let's see what he does with it. He thinks it's alive. A slimy glove of snot. You can play with everything. That cat does. Oh yeah, he likes some clouds. He likes little color layering clouds. Yeah, he's trying to get him. Oh. Boy, I'll tell you, this thing's got like CD music. Like it's only an eight-bit pro. It's only like an eight-bit that it does. If it was a sixteen-bit CD, that thing like I think it probably sounds good. They're trying to get like a. Uh, CD sound processor or something. Can't remember. Um. Anyway, let's see. Oh, well. Shoot, I need to be keeping track of how long I've been cooking them fish sticks because I don't want to leave them in there. I could very well forget about them. They've probably been in there about 10 minutes now. I'm supposed to cook them for 15 minutes and flip them over, cook them for 15 more minutes. So I'm going to have to be sure to go in there and do that. And I don't know if I'm going to remember or not. If I forget about them, I'm going to be so angry. Because it's the only snack around here that I got that I can eat. It's really... They play the same music when you're fighting Dracula. But when it gets to this part right here, it starts over. It's really cool, it sounds good. It's just basically, it's just neat. Um, I can hear that fish sizzling in there. It's just time I started on this. Okay, here we go. All these games have different sounds whenever you uh, enter your name. And Ghouls and Ghosts it does that cool sound that I always like to listen to. Of course, I've only got one tape of Ghouls and Ghosts that I haven't dubbed over already. I've considered that to be a private tape, too. It's the only one, that's the only private tape I have with Mary in it. I had that one on April 16th, and I just got fed up with listening to it. I just taped over it, now the tape doesn't even work anymore. I don't remember why. The music is really good on this game, I'll tell you. There's really only two buttons you use, it's Y to whip and B to jump. And that's just basically all there is to it. And the cats have settled down at last. Can't believe it. Well, this is going to be a really simple game to beat with one hand, I'll tell you. It doesn't really require any fancy maneuvers or anything like that. The way a overhead view game would, you know, like Contra 3. And that Contra 3, when you get out in level 2, you know, and you have to use L and R to rotate it so you can face different directions. Your, char your character is always facing up toward the top of the screen, so you can't use L and R to turn your character to face in different directions. You use L and R and turn the entire screen so that it rotates. And, like, if you rotate clockwise at a 90 degree angle, you'll be facing in a different direction because your character is still facing up. You know, it always faces up no matter where you rotate. Yeah, that would be really hard to do with one hand because you have to operate about five or six different buttons. You'd have the shooting button, and if I ever learned to duck real well with by using B, so you have to use B to duck. 
on that. Duck down, avoid the bullets, and haven't mastered that yet. It's hard enough just to keep track of shooting and being sure to rotate the right way, you know. I'm used to the rotation now. I used to be kind of rough. I couldn't get used to it. Can you hear that? I don't know if you can or not. Um, shoot, I need to be changing the fish, fish sticks around. I'm going to be done in a little while. I like the music when you fight a boss on this. It's really, I never let you listen to it on the other tape. And I'm dubbing over that tape right now, I think. Sure, yeah, sure am. Dubbing over the other side. Or we were watching Back to the Future 2 or something. And I was talking about, like, oh, guess where he is? He's in Athens. That's why I started liking Athens City, you know. I like the name of it. After Athens, you know, they're real scary. Like, don't do that to the name Athens. Uh, Athens, it sounds, it sounds fine the way it is. And then you put that J in there. I used to think J was just a sinister letter, like in typing. I really hated that letter in typing because I messed up all the time. I don't know, they, they say dreams are what you fear, and I guess, I don't know if that has anything to do with it. You know, some, a lot of my tapes, I always say, I don't know if, I don't know if, I don't know if, you know, I'm always sitting there, I don't know if this, I don't know if that. You know, I bet you Zelda 3 would be hard to beat with one hand. As you know, you got to use A for the dash attack, not to mention the, when you're using B for the sword instead of to jump, you know. When you play it with one hand, you get used to this after a while. If I get used to jumping with this button, then I'm using my middle finger to push. Them. Yeah, I'm using my right thumb to operate the control pad to move Simon around and up and down stairs. And where he whips. And then I got my middle finger on the jump button, and I got my index finger on the whip button. That's all you really need. And I can always reach up there and hit R if I need to use my stopwatch or dagger or holy water or something. And that might be a little more difficult if I'm trying to use... Uh, like holy water against the mummy at the top of the clock tower, for instance. Shoot, I didn't let you listen to the music. It doesn't matter, you can probably hear it anyway. Uh, you see what happens? Every time I start talking about Nintendo games, you know, I don't stop. Uh, that wasn't too much of a problem. Something happened to my leg, and every time I so much as slap it or touch it or anything like that, it feels like it's stinging. There's a bunch of needles sticking into it. I need to go flip the fish over. Hold on. Oh, that stove was hot. Here we go. We're gonna shoot. Gee. That was bad snot right there. I hate to do this in front of you, you know, but it's really dumb. I don't know what you think about. Eventually one of those purple hands is gonna get me if I don't move it pretty soon. Ooh. Dude, you got me already. Can't do it. Just gotta move around. I gotta get used to not using the A button because I don't need to be. Um, right on top of that money bag too. I've only a hundred points. I'm starting to get used to not having any company anymore. You know how Sherry moved away? Well, she hasn't moved away, but Mark moved away. Josh and Ashley are out in Augusta. Augusta, Georgia. I thought at first they were moving to Arizona or something to live with their dad, you know. I found out they're going to Augusta, and that's not half as far away. It's only about like an hour. The lake house is further away than that is. The lake house is an hour and a half. Steve said he'd much rather go to Lake Oconee than Lake Lanier because it's so much closer. Like Oconee is an hour, uh, an hour and a half away. It's probably an hour and a half away from Commerce, and then only an hour away from Athens, because you know it's a half an hour from Commerce to Athens. You know. Yeah, I do have some common sense. Uh, of course, I guess that's something I should have known a long time ago. When people are born to know that kind of stuff. Not. What the heck? Hm. That was kind of cool. I saw something suspicious in one of the background designs on this game. Looks like somebody used a little bit of color layering somewhere. Some black. Some trash. 
Maybe I need to talk about something else. We have super burp coming. <coughs> well, they don't turn out good the way they used to. You know? It used to be so funny. You know? Go ahead, disappear, boomerang, if I can get my pork chop. Oh, look at that. Stupid boomerang wouldn't disappear if I didn't get to get my pork chop. Not that I can do anything with this clock. Well, maybe I can. Oh my god, I might as well take advantage of it. No, oh, no, it's staggering. Half as good as the clock. Ha! Eat that bird. This comes right back for you. See, they can still hurt you even when you got the clock going. Well, if I'm trying to beat it with one hand, it doesn't matter if I lose a man. I just, if I run out of men, then I'm not gonna have to start over. Shoot, I ain't never gonna beat this idiot. It's too hard to avoid him. You can hit him a lot, but you can't avoid him a lot. It's constantly things coming at you from all directions, and you can't, with one hand, it's just not enough to get through it. You need it better. I'm trying to use it with the side of my thumb so I can reach the, and I can't reach the buttons with my other fingers unless I use the side of my thumb to push the button. That's, that's what's causing me to lose. If I'm using the wrong part of my thumb. You know, Aladdin loves to watch me play Castle Thing 4 in the rotating room whenever you're, after it rotates the first time, it goes and rotates the second time, and then you're waiting for the blocks to appear. And, uh, there's that suspicious looking design again. Uh, and then you move up and down while you're hanging on to that thing right there. I'm doing pretty good now. Yeah, that bird right there that was getting me last time. Come through with full life. I need to talk about something else. This is going to be so boring. Some of these things are just... I wish I could, you know, just have a decent tape to listen to, something that's fun to listen to. Something that's just, I don't know. Hmm. Uh-oh. Trouble. Oh, he's beating me. He's beating me by a little bit now. I only got one hit left. Two hits if I'm lucky. Crap! Jeez! Liz! Hey, what kind of... Stay out of this, Aladdin! I'm trying to scratch my leg. Can't you see that? I need a different finger to push the pause button. I wish I just had a decent platform on which to place the controller so I could play it. Well, this dang bird don't get out of here pretty soon. Not gonna be that easy. I already knocked out about 10 out of my 16 bars. Things shouldn't take away so much life when they're that hard to avoid. The frogs aren't enough. Just gotta be sure and get that pork chop down here. It's right here. Isn't it? Ah, I don't need frogs to be getting me here. Now the one last thing. I don't care if I get that boomerang. Pork chop's more important than that. Yeah, if I get the boomerang, I'll tear up that Medusa head. I never thought she'd be that hard to defeat I mean, with one hand, you know. As it is, I don't have enough strength to do much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Sometimes it's interesting to watch the cat look up at you when you burp and he doesn't know what you're doing, you know. Um, well, oh, I got a pork chop again. Definitely need that. Um, I need to be taking that fish out of the oven just about, about five minutes from now. And I'm anxious to get in there and eat it. We don't have tartar sauce, so I use mayonnaise. Just as good. Ha! See how you like that, butt wipe. Yeah, I beat him without getting hit now. Maybe I got hit once. So stupid. 
And all the times I could have done that, I have to do it whenever it's not necessary. Not that I don't want to beat him without getting hit, but... Cat, do you have to be? No. Stop. I need to be talking, shoot. Oh. I guess I'm doing pretty good. I hate whenever that water current pushes me the other way. It's not always so easy. Shoot, this tape is going to be so boring to listen to. It's going to be pathetic. I'm laying down my list of things to say in the first 15 minutes. Well, anyway. Hmm. Well, you know, playing Super Nintendo games with one hand is not as easy because you got, as I've already said, you're pushing more buttons and jumping. I should just delve over this tape without even listening to it because I know, for one thing, that this is going to be a very boring tape to listen to. In fact, just whenever you whenever you put in a Nintendo game and play it while you're making a tape, you just, all you do is sit there and talk about the stupid Nintendo game. Hopefully I can make it to board four before the stupid tape runs out. Which means I'm not going to take the secret route to get free pork chops. Even though I'll probably save a heck of a lot more time by doing it. Jeez, look at me, I'm talking about Nintendo game, I swear. Why can't I make a tape while I'm doing something that doesn't involve the whole tape? It just comes naturally, I guess. So they're playing a Nintendo game, they're gonna talk about it, probably. That's why I should just shouldn't be playing the Nintendo game. See, I'm trying to beat this thing with one hand. Duh, shoot. I'm gonna tell you a bunch of stuff that you already know. You're repeating it again and again. I don't know how that one's gonna turn out. Hmm. I thought this music was cool the first time I got there. I was just saying I could see myself later in life waiting to get to this part so I could hear this music. This show is good music. They got really a lot of good music in this game. Zelda 3, they got uh, music in the town and the music in the sanctuary. That's all the music that Shane likes. And he asks why they don't put more good music like that in there. Sometimes I wonder myself, why not? You better not be farting around with anything, cat, because I'm just, not that I'm already used to you. I don't need to take that fish out now. I gotta go ahead and get to the end of this level. I'll take it out. I'll let you listen to the music afterward. Well, geez, if I don't get up these stairs, the tape's gonna run out. Um. I'm holding the controller practically sideways. It's no wonder I'm confused about these buttons. It seems like the jump button should be more to the right of that button instead of practically above it. Or it should be. Try something super. Oh, I knew I wouldn't be able to do it with one hand. Can't do anything with one hand. There we go. I can still collect the items pretty much. Good. A rotating room is going to be a doozy for me with this one hand business, you know. And the oven's clicking, that's probably the omen that I should be checking it. Jeez, I don't feel like going through this again, but I think I'm gonna have to. Jeez, I keep thinking I'm gonna push the wrong button. But that's not the case. Dude, if I can keep without getting hit by these birds, I can get a pork chop up here and I'll probably beat these vortex vipers without having to try again. Even until I get further into the music when I play with only one hand, because I do everything slower. 
I don't know what kind of super burps I like better, the ones that go, <laughs> or the ones that go, uh, you know, the real loud ones, you know, kind of like I'm screaming, you know. Oh, those are pretty good burps. Some burps, you know, some of them aren't that funny, because they just don't. Mm -mm. Come on, come on, come on. There you go. Take him down. Hmm. Tore him up. Dude, I got him half dead already. Dude, this is fun, man. Fun to kick butt. I was scared I wouldn't be able to beat these guys at first. I beat them without getting hit. Hmm. There's a tiny itty bitty bitty bug on my foot. I don't believe it. Oh, Aladdin's sleeping again. That's hard to believe. Hmm. I wish you could see the graphics right here where the scaling, you know. Gets real big. I'm only saying I've never seen a machine that could do that, but Vectrex could do it too. Vectrex has a lot of scaling on it. First thing you see when you play Mindstorm, the ship's flying down. That's contract scaling once again there's two t two kinds of scaling there's the expansion and contraction expansion scaling is when things get big and contract like duh man listen to the music while I get the fish I guess I could do that I don't like to take a chance but I'll give it a try like that for so long. I'm about to run out of time on this thing. Oh. Besides, you've already been through the entire music cycle about one and a half times. Now. See this music that they do right here, where it changes? Let's start playing this music in level 4-3, sort of. If you already know the music in 4-3, you'll definitely recognize it. Especially right here where it goes up a little bit. If you ignore that front voice there, you know that makes it sound a little bit better. You definitely recognize it, but she just takes it out to run out, isn't it? Well, let me pause it so you can go in here and hear the music in level four or three. Okay, I'm back now. Let's see here. I'm sure you're gonna recognize. Look at that, my snot's dripping from the TV again. double dose of that music you don't see her very often. It's too bad they don't do more of this uh, these graphics, you know. 
Like that room that I was just in. One day I made it through this thing without having to wait for it. Stupid destiny keeps me, makes me lose in all the time. I tend to blame that baby on Rescue 911, that mother and everything. If she, her baby had just been saved and asked her, what are you going to name her? She says, Destiny something. I thought it was so beautiful and everything. The Destiny sucks, man, I tell you what. Stupid as H-E-L-L. You get to hear this coronet music, I don't know. Up, this is Timothy Bishop, July 12th, 1992. Fifth tape I've made in one day. Hopefully the best. More like hopefully the only, because I want to try to get a lot of different subjects on this tape. And in order to do that, I'm going to have to think fast. Oh, please, not on this tape. Um, I'm going to try to watch TV if I can, find something to draw my attention. Usually tapes are pretty good when I do that. Um, I was playing Castlevania 4 earlier. The cat messed me up. I'm trying to be in one last thing. I got to the third stage in the middle of that cave. The cat was clawing at my hands and made me fall on the spikes. I just forgave him for it. And he's still going to keep doing this stuff to me, so. There's now a whole heck of a lot going on. Um, Dad and Mary are still down at Lake Lanier. They left at about 10 o'clock this morning, or 10.30 or something. And now it's 7.30, and they're not back. It's about 7.30 anyway. I want to be absolutely precise about telling the truth. Anyway, I'm already yearning to go back to Mom's house, to be honest. And you can just be away from there for two days, and it's like you're yearning to go back already. You just get so desperate to go back there. You can't enjoy the time when you need it, you know, when you get it. It's hard to believe I was actually with them the day before yesterday. I haven't really been that long. I know it seems a lot longer since we've been at the bowling alley than it does, but we've been at Parsons. We were at Parsons and ate. And Mary and Erica and Christopher and me and Pat and Dennis and Mom and Steve. All of us were there. Ah, uh, and uh, we ate. And yeah, all our bills together were like $50. I mean, our Dennis family had a total of twenty two eighty nine. I just got some fried chicken like I usually do. Parsons has got good fried chicken. So that's what I usually get. Um, well, I need to be talking about something interesting, you know. What would you suppose that this tape would be? On a scale of 1 to 10, 10 being the most interesting. Oh, dude. That's a tornado on TV there, on the news. That's the kind of weather I like right there, cloudy. I don't care much for the tornado, but I do like the cloudiness. So we have thunderstorm watch over Kansas, Nebraska, Missouri, and maybe part of Iowa. Of course, that's what you should expect. There's also some in Ohio and Indiana over part of Lake Erie, I think that is. I always get Lake Erie and Lake Ontario confused. I still don't know. I guess the only way I remember it is like if they go in alphabetical order from left to right. Either they do or they don't. And that was severe thunderstorm watch over the Atlantic, coming into Maryland, Delaware, and Virginia. And some of New Jersey. Um, I don't know why you care about that. Just thought you might want to know. Not that you were asking me, but why don't you tell me when there's some severe thunderstorm watches around you know? Anyway. I don't know why I'm burping so much. It really doesn't make a difference. I don't laugh at them anyway. They're just sort of there on the tape, you know. I just, I don't know why I don't make any more good burps. See, I don't have any carbonated drinks over here, so I can't get any powerful burps or super burps or anything. What I really want to be doing is getting some notebook paper and making a burp book. That's what I really ought to be doing. Uh, get away from that wire, Aladdin. Please don't make me do this. Not on this tape. Um, no, no, no. He's gonna learn eventually. He knows what it means. No. All right. I have the water on my fingers if I have to. Can you still hear me? I'll take this up here. 
Gotta keep my fingers soaking in that water. He's gonna be soaking wet if he ever does anything dumb again. He's got a little weird looking mustache on the TV there. Why is it I be changing the channels and all of a sudden I just stop like that, I wonder. I guess when Aladdin disturbs me because too many times I've been on these tapes. No! 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 Uh, he'll feel that when you put water on him. It drives him nuts. Anyway. I have a men's health advisor. I wonder what that is. I wonder if that tells you anything about... Well, this is men's health advisor. Probably doesn't say anything about adolescence or sexual growth. Or anything about ejaculation, you know. It's not even in the Bible. Ejaculation isn't... I don't know if it's really a word or not. Look at that. Nobody has it. Erection. Failure to achieve. I've never had a failure to achieve an erection. When I wake up in the morning, i got a hard dick almost every morning that I wake up. Ah. Uh, why men cheat? Failure. Huh. Hmm. Well, I don't really see anything a whole lot about ejaculation or junk. You know, I go through at least three a week. Because, you know, it's hard to resist the temptation to do something that feels good. I don't want to pull that microphone out of the recorder, but I want to lean back on the couch in a comfortable position. I'm sure you're not going to be able to hear me. I don't know if the microphone's going to pick me up or not, but I have to talk into it. And if I want to talk without it right on my mouth. Aladdin, there are about a thousand different places in this house that you could sit. And you're sitting in the one place where I need to move something. So would you please move, stupid destiny worshiper? You just bring about destiny and keep it there. Whatever destiny causes me to one in a thousand chance that this thing's gonna happen to me and it happens. And if destiny has it that you're gonna sit there for an hour before I get the chance to put that book back where it belongs, I don't want Dad getting mad at me for reading that stuff. And of course, why would he get mad at me for just wanting to learn? Can't. Cat, no. Stop. Stop. I'm going to put up with you today. No. I got my fingers soaking up water right now. If I have to, I'm going to bring them to justice. No. No. Pulling this string away from you. Stay away from there. Stay away from there, okay? I'm just going to pull the string away. No. Let me have my string. No, no, no. You understand that? Gee, it's gonna be so aggravating. But anyway, I think uh, basically I'm gonna try to devote this tape to something else besides talking to the cat, if I can.